Good morning to you, my friends. I'm Cork, and this is Amazing Frog. And today, well, I really want to discover these aliens that I keep hearing about. Honestly, I didn't even know that they were going to be in this update. But people keep telling me, oh, there's aliens here, oh, there's aliens there. I haven't found any aliens so far, so I'm going to try again. I've been told that there are aliens on the moon. And I know that there's going to be, like, a flying saucer vehicle added. But I don't think it's out just yet. Whoa, look at this loading screen. Oh, well, we didn't get to look at it for very long. But it was still cool. Okay, I'm here. I don't have a spacesuit. Could be a problem. Maybe not. Let's just uh, pick up a gun. Nope, put it away. There we go. Is there a spacesuit out here? Oh, there's a map of the map of the place. Was that here last time? I don't know. It's so hard to remember. All the things keep changing so often. Uh, I feel like I need a space suit. I feel like... What's out? Whoa. Okay. Into the void. Is there still a space suit down here? Yes, there is. Okay, we're just gonna grab that real quick. Grab the fly pack. And off we go. Let's find some aliens. Let's find some aliens. There's probably some aliens out here. Wow, it's like... Very bright. I don't remember the moon being this bright. Hello? Are you an alien, sir? Hmm, I don't trust that face very much. What is this? Oh, it's a controller for that. When was that added? I remember that. I remember that, but I don't remember it very well. Hold on, hold on. No, I need to activate it. There we go. There we are. I remember this being a thing. I don't remember why, but the remote-controlled moon buggy. That's kind of like one of those really old videos I made way, way, way back. There was a glitch I discovered that allowed you to remotely control pretty much any vehicle. Oh my goodness, that's a lot. That was a throwback. <laughs> that just made me think of a video I made like so many years ago. Anyways, we're here looking for some aliens. Now, if I remember way back to the old days of Amazing Frog, at the top of this here satellite chain, there is a UFO if you go way, way up high. It's invisible. So, you can't just see it from down here, because I think it's supposed to be a secret. Maybe that's where the aliens are? I don't think there were ever any aliens in it. But maybe there are now. And with this fly pack, boy howdy, it'll be easy to get up there. If anything, it'll be a vantage point to see what else is around here. Anything different? I still hear, like, a fan. <laughs> what is this background noise? <laughs> I think this is the noise that you're supposed to hear in the space station, but it just keeps playing. Oh, hey, there's Earth. That's lovely. That's just great. All right. Well, I don't see anything very different just yet. So I guess I just keep going up. There's the meteor where the frog and car uh, carbonite? Is that it? I'm not a big Star Wars guy. Um, but I think that's what it is. Like Han Solo or something. I don't know. Oh, there's the UFO. Look at that. See, it's, it's invisible to get close enough. Or at least that's how it used to be. I think it still is because I didn't see it. But maybe that's just because I wasn't paying attention. It's always possible. It's very difficult to get in there without any fly pack. <laughs> but with this, it should be, it should be just fine. Up we go. And away. Where? Where are the aliens? There's no aliens in this UFO. Huh. I would have... Uh, if you were to ask me where the aliens would be on the moon, I'd say in the alien ship. But no, no, there's nothing in here. Interesting. Have I been bamboozled? Is someone bamboozling me? Maybe on top? No. Nothing on top. Why are we bamboozling people? Hey, that's not very nice. Well, I guess a complete investigation of the entire moon is now in order. That's fun. I'm gonna go over here and see if there's anything different up here. Hello. Anything special? Oh, there isn't even the, the frog up here. Yet. I guess that'll probably be added later, or maybe not. I guess it was kind of like a little easter egg. I don't know. There's all kind of references in this game. Well, if I were an alien, where would I be? I mean, I think we've already established that. I'd be in the UFO. Maybe inside the statue? Maybe? 
I don't know. Hello? Hello? Nope, still just a pig. Nothing else. Where are these aliens? Do they even exist? I feel like... I feel like I'm being made a fool of. I feel like someone's pulling my leg, yanking my chain, pulling the wool over my eyes, all kinds of stuff. Little worms. Hello. Don't mind me if I don't s stop and visit. I'm on a mission to find aliens. I guess technically these do classify as aliens, the worms. But I want, I want smart aliens, not dumb stupid aliens like you. What's this? What's this? A little satellite dish and a moon buggy? Hmm. I don't think a moon buggy would be faster to get around here. Another frog zapper. I'm just gonna stick with flying. It's probably better. Um, what's this? It's just a, a, a rock? What's this green stuff next to it? Is that just propane? Or helium? Or something? I don't know. Yeah, looks like it. Oh, there's a frog face in it. That's interesting. I, I'm out of here. Too much attention. What's this? Is that a cannon? I don't remember there being cannons on the moon. That doesn't... Oh, no, that's one of those. Oh, uh, yeah, it's one of the fans. Looked like a cannon from the angle I was at. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh, eh, okay. Well, that... Uh, oh, that's the Space Invaders game, right? Uh, yeah. I forgot about that being a thing. Huh. Interesting that that's still in this version of the game. Can I do anything with it? Can I be... Can I destroy the Space Invaders? Are these what we consider aliens? <laughs> Can I, I... I believe before I could, like, run into them and they'd turn into pixels. Oh my goodness, but there's so much more noise this time. <laughs> what happens if I destroy them all? And the last one. No more space invaders. Right? Yeah. Well, I don't think anyone's, uh... Gonna do anything about that, so... I'll just keep exploring somewhere else, I suppose. Another buggy? No aliens. No signs of intelligent life thus far. Not even the astronauts. What's going on here? Wait, what's this? What's going on here? Wait. <gasps> aliens. I found them. They do exist. And they don't look very happy. Well, I mean, maybe that's just their natural face. Hey! What is that you're holding? Hello? Oh my. Are you gonna hit me with that or something? Because I, I kind of want that. That looks really cool. Could I just... Could I just have that? Could I have that without having to, uh... Resort to violence? Hold on. Fall down. Fall down. Fall down. Give it, give it, give it. No, I don't. Well, I got him now. Um, uh, guys, uh, well, uh, guys, look away. Look away. Look away for just a second, please. Just one second. Just one second. Look away. Look away. You're supposed to. You're not looking, right? Yep, you're not looking. Nope. We're not looking. Not looking. My goodness, this guy is durable. Um, uh, I mean, stop. Don't. No, no looking. Nope. No one's looking, right? There we go. Yep. No looking. No looking. Um,. Stop looking. I'm not hurting anybody. We're, we're, this is called a negotiation. Peaceful negotiation. Okay, this, what is, okay, this is, well, I, uh, don't exactly know what to do about that. I'll tell you what, I really want to have one of their weapons, but, um, these guys seem really tough. There's so many of them out here. Are you guarding something? Is there, like, a base around here? Or are you just standing around because? Hello? Any base? Any space base? Nope. Okay, cool. They're just standing around because they want to. Or something like that. Interesting. Are they invincible or do they just have incredible amounts of health? If anyone knows if you can, uh, take one of their weapons in one way or another. Let me know, because those look really fun. But I don't think I can, I don't think I can take them. Huh, 
If I had like a tank or something up here, I'd really give him the business. Give me your weapon. No. Maybe I could bring him with me. Nope. Stop. Stop. Come here. Come here. Come come here. Come here. Whoa. Hold on. Nope. Come here. Come here. Come here. <gasps> no, he did the invisible thing. But he's still there. Oh man. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Nope, he's alive again. Okay, now you're mine. Stop falling over. No, stop falling over. Can I? I cannot fly with him. No, I wanted to. I wanted to bring him to the base to do testing and stuff. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, well, that's intriguing. Not sure if there's any way to get their weapons, but I want to. But hey, I found aliens, so that's pretty cool. Before I end this episode, though, I want to do one more thing. But that's back in Swindon. I want to go to the runway because I was told about a new glitch. About how to get underneath the... Well, every time I come here, I'm astonished by how loud these things are. I've been told about a glitch about how to get underneath the world. And I kind of want to take a look at that. So, we're going to see if I can recreate it. I was instructed to use a jet and go up really, really high. And after that, it's kind of fuzzy. I don't remember quite exactly what I'm supposed to do. But I'm going to eject and uh, not get out of the seat. And then I'm going to spin and then fall to the ground. And it should allow me to break through the barrier. Which, I guess there's only one way to find out. So, what's the eject button? B? A? Uh, what button is it? That's, that's, uh, okay, I turned on the ink. Um, oh, that's it. I guess it's just Y. Okay, now I'm going to spin, spin really, really fast as I fall to the ground. And I'm going to gain speed, and this will allow me to drill through the earth. And we'll see if this is actually the right way to do it. Uh, but it looks, oh no, it looks like I'm about to land in the water. That doesn't seem... No, I'll be good. I'll be good. I'll be just fine. Oh, there's the train. And... Uh, <gasps> Whoa! You're absolutely right. That worked perfectly. And I've been told that there's stuff down here. Like in the out, out of bounds of the... Whatchamacallit? Uh, sewers. There are things down here where they put assets for like screenshots and stuff. Out of bounds, where nobody would ever see them. Unless you're me, who has an awesome community who tells you about glitches. What is that big glowy thing? Uh, am I going up or am I not? I kind of feel like I'm not going up. Which is kind of concerning. I'd like to not be down here. I want to go, whoa. There's a whole place over there set up for screenshots and stuff. I want to go up. No, I'm sinking. <laughs> I was told to use the balloon pack down here because it's easier to fly with and go up. Ah oh, man. Come on, why can't I go up? Do I just have too much downward momentum or something? Huh? Am I lifting? Do we have liftoff? Are we going up now? Am I? I can't really tell. I need to see. No, I'm still going down. You can see by the way my lines are trailing. <laughs> Uh, well, hey, the glitch worked. So, hey, thank you so much for that. That's an awesome little thing. I'm all about glitches in this game. Uh, so that's super cool. Maybe we'll be able to do some exploration. If you find anything down here with this glitch, anything, like, of substance, because, like, I know about the floating things, so those are going to be, like, scenes for screenshots and stuff for promotional whatever. That's just how game development works, as far as I know. I'm not a huge authority on it, but... That was super cool. Thank you for telling me about that glitch, and really good on you for finding it. Well done. We found the aliens, and we did a little bit more glitch hunting, which is, you know, what more can you ask for? So these guys up here protesting about the aliens, well, maybe they're right after all. They are coming, and maybe I should be afraid in particular. Aliens stole my snowman. Well, if you have any other information or things you want me to investigate or other secrets that you have discovered, Please let me know, absolutely, and I will try and take a look at them. But as for now, 
Until next time, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this episode of Amazing Frog. If you did, leave a like, and if you haven't already and you would like to, subscribe to see more Amazing Frog and all the other things I post right here on this channel. And as always, guys, in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.